Hello there. Today, I'll be taking you on your first step into a larger world by totally converting your rim world into the Star Wars galaxy. Now, this is where the fun begins. Our first mod and what will make up the core of our total conversion is the O21 Outer Rim Galaxies mod. This mod adds in the Clone Wars and Galactic Civil War eras into our rim world. So now you can play as the clones, the droid army, the empire, the rebels, Mandalorian Death Watch, and even the Chiss Ascendancy. And you will have access to all their weapons, apparel, and armor. It also adds in 25 races into RimWorld, including the Zabrax, Wookiees, Sith, Togrudas, Twi'leks, Trendotians, and way more. And by the way, the Ithorians in it even have their concussive stream ability, which is just awesome. There are also a few extra race mods, which will add even more Star Wars races into the world, like Rodanians and Dance. Some will double up with our core mod, but that's okay, it won't break anything. The Outer Rim Galaxy mod even adds in new buildings and crafting materials to work with such as Beskar and Druid Steel and you can even harness Tabana Das to power giant Imperial Turbo Lasers. I mean, it's all just mental. And to top it off, this mod even has working lightsabers from a more civilized age. Currently in development are the Old Republic factions along with the Force mechanic, but in the meantime, there are some other mods to add this into RimWorld. <laughs> I mean, sorry, the Star Wars Galaxy. Speaking of the Force, the Star Wars Force Continues lets your colonists learn how to use the Force if they have the Force Sensitive trait. The Force powers available are Force Choke, Force Rage, Force Lightning, Force Storm, Force Heal, Force Defense, Mind Trick, Force Ghost, Force Push and Pull, and Force Speed. Oh, we did it! The light and dark side powers are restricted to your colonists after they have chosen their path, while force push and pull and speed are neutral skills. Now, if you're gonna go up against force users, you are gonna need some protection. There are quite a lot of armor mods out there and I really love them all as they look so amazing and they help craft your own unique story. I mean, just look at all this clone armor you can get from JDS Phase 1 and Phase 2 armor mods. They have everything and they look so amazing. Not to mention the custom Mandalorian mod packs and others which add unique characters like Darth Vader, Darth Revan, Mando, Jango and Boba Fett and tons more. If we have the armor, we might as well have the ship to go with it. So, Madman's SRTS Star Wars ships add ships from primarily the Old Republic and the Clone Wars eras, and they are amazing. I personally have had so much fun landing the LAAT Dunships and raiding Separatist bases, liberating their planet from oppression. And also, the modder currently has 19 more Civil War era ships in the making. Your Star Wars universe would not be complete without its wildlife. For you to live peacefully with, hunt, or be hunted by. A lot of these animals can be harvested for the crafting materials, but just don't upset the Rancor or the Crate Dragon or you will have a bad day. The Star Wars biome mod adds a ton of Star Wars biomes, including Felucia, Endor, Mustafa, Hoth, and tons more. These biomes combined with the wildlife add a true authentic experience. Just look at those Tontons go. What's that, Master Yoda? Music? Mightier than the lightsaber it is. Well, Yoda thinks music is pretty powerful, so why not add in the better Star Wars soundtrack? This mod adds an undercurrent of atmosphere and emotion to your actions in true Star Wars fashion, with 329 music tracks added from the Star Wars universe. And if that isn't enough, there's even a First Order mod, which adds the First Order faction to the mix. The modder really has done a great job with this mod. It looks very nice. The apparel is great and the weapon models look awesome. Now, if you want to have a true total conversion experience, make sure when you're starting, you turn off all other factions except for Star Wars only. And prepare carefully or the character editor a must have so you can customize your own story. Also, make sure you go into the Outer Rim Galaxies mod and turn on the Imperial Raid noise. It is flipping awesome. If you like this video, why not like and subscribe to my channel and help bring balance to the force. And let me know in the comments if you would like an in-depth video on any of these mods. Also, I'd love to hear what kind of stories you're going to make with them. And this video is your next step on your RimWorld journey. Now, may the Force be with you as you go out and thrive in the Rim.